Viruses have the ability to infect all living things, from bacteria to animals to extreme microorganisms that can survive in uniquely harsh environments. They have been with us throughout history, and they evolved alongside life itself, even though viruses are not technically alive, which is why they need their hosts to survive. A group of scientists from Tokyo University of Science, Kyoto University, Tokyo Institute of Technology, and the National Institute for Physiological Science has discovered a new type of giant virus and named it Medusa virus for its ability to petrify amoebas. When a virus invades an organism, it alters its genetic code in order to replicate itself. This can leave a mark, a fingerprint on the host's DNA that is then passed on for generations. This interaction is mutual and it is called lateral gene transfer or LGT. Host and virus co-evolve. This is why the amoeba has in its genome proteins that encode for the virus's major capsid protein, even though it doesn't need one. Scientists think that it is through the same LGT mechanism that eukaryotic cells acquired their DNA replication machinery. The Medusa virus, unlike most viruses, contains genes that encode for a full set of proteins involved in DNA transaction named histones. This is novel because smaller viruses don't do this. The Medusa virus DNA goes inside the amoeba's nucleus and uses its own DNA polymerase to complete replication. According to the phylogenetic analysis, the eukaryotic DNA polymerase could have originated with the ancient Medusa virus. However, the role of Medusa virus histones remains to be explained.